So next up on the Everything Gotta Go giveaway is the JJRC H36. I don't see it any, oh, there it is. Ha. Okay, let's see if I can pull these out, like pulling a tablecloth out. Wait, 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 wait. I've always wanted to do this. And the flowers are still standing. Oh yeah. So here is the JJRC H36. And this was a pretty good drone. This was my first ducted fan drone and it worked pretty good. These were also rebranded as the Isheen E010, which I have one of those too. So I'm just gonna open this up and make sure that everything works on it all right. And then I'm gonna put it in the giveaway if it does. So this will not be a review. It's just a quick overlook just to see how it works. If you wanna see the review, right up there is where you'll be able to find it. It's one of my earlier videos and they are a little bit slower paced. So try and bear with them. But let's get this out of the box. You'll get a set of instructions. You'll get the controller, which takes two double A's. And then we also have some spare propellers and a USB charger. So let's take this battery out of here. It's a 3.7 volt, 150 milliamp hour single cell LiPo. It's not puffed, so that's one good sign. Well, we'll give it a few minutes and see if anything happens. Well, I've been charging it for about 40 minutes. This light went off on the battery bank and that only goes off when there's no power being drawn from it, but it didn't indicate that it was full. There was no red light and a red light comes on when that's full. Just, we're just gonna have to try this battery. See if we can get that to power on. And if we can see how long we can fly it. So no on and off switch, just plug it in. That turns it on. Well, we have power. That's a good sign up, down. Now we have a bind, let's see. Well, as you can see, we have a little bit of a problem. So when I tried to take off, this propeller wasn't spinning. So I wanted to try and pull this propeller off or at least pull it up on the motor shaft a little further because sometimes the propellers are pushed down too tight on the motor. They don't want to spin as easy. I tried pulling it and when I did, the motor slipped out of my fingers and I actually ripped this wire. But that's okay because now I just created more content for myself. So I'm gonna buy a complete set of new motors and see if I can re-solder all of them on. I've never done it before, but I'd love to give it a try. So we're gonna have to put this giveaway on hold for a little bit until I can get the new motors and get them installed. Also, while I'm at it, I need to get a new battery because the propellers, the ones that were spinning, weren't spinning very fast, almost like the battery's pretty much dead. So I'm gonna get a new battery. So stay tuned for more on this JJRC H36. I really didn't think that I'd be creating more videos on this, but now I have the opportunity, so I'm gonna do it. So thanks for watching. Click the subscribe button if you wanna see more on the H36. I'll see you on the next one.